Sometimes you need a camera to give you guys tips about what has helped us with our coin business. But today we're gonna to take this camera along so we can show you one of the biggest coin purchases that we've ever made, $35,000. We hope you guys enjoy. We wanna wish you guys a happy 4th of July. We hope you had a good time with family and friends. We just wanted to show you what we hung on our house. We hung, hang this flag every single year just to uh, honor the sacrifice. Uh, someone else took our place, stood in our place, and allowed us to have the freedoms that we have now. And so uh, one quick thing before we go, the reason why we're driving to pick these coins up is because of the value of the coins. Um, it, it's a very expensive package. And sometimes when you ship things through the postal service or, or UPS, it can get very scary, especially for the customer. And so we want to have the white glove service today. We want to drive all the way to his house and drive back just to make sure everything is what it is and where it is. And so uh, sometimes it'll cost you a day, but you'll be the customer will be happy and you'll have some nice coins to come home to. So let's go get those coins. Come along with us. So the reason why we have this deal to begin with is for a few reasons but the main reason was someone on facebook asked for someone's help for cc and so what we told the guy was hey we're going to drive all the way to your house and we're going to pick up these coins and yeah we ended up picking them up driving them all the way back sending them cac for them no charge and then we brought them back to him so we drove four hours to get there four hours to get back and we did the same thing to return the coins. And so, you know, when someone says, oh, you know, someone got this something on a silver platter in life, most of the time you don't might not know what you're talking about. Um, so we're going to go get these coins. And it's been good because uh, we were able to help him, you know, acquire more coins. But also, uh, you know, like times like these, we're able to buy the coins for a reasonable price and bring them to you guys. And so keep working at getting those coin deals because you're definitely going to need them if you're going to grow your coin business <sighs> the cool thing about what had happened was was when we drove actually to his house he opened his house with warm welcomes and uh just was a really nice genuine guy he said you know whenever i was asking him like hey why did you let us in your house bro it's like you're showing us this much coins, you're showing this this much value that you have um, in your personal portfolio. And he's like, Drew, I watched four minutes of your YouTube video and I knew you were the guy that was going to pick up these coins and send them to CEC. Guys, start making videos. Start making things that you like and putting them in video content, content form, because people really want to see you. They really want to know you. They like the coins, but they want to know you so definitely a humbling experience it's really great to get this uh you know all finished up and uh i don't know it's just uh it's surreal i'm very happy that we're able to uh get nice coins like this but also meet a nice collector along the way that's what it's really about all right guys so we made it to the house it's seven o'clock now so we have to drive all the way back but we have the coins right here um just a few to show you off the bat. I mean, we got 19 in this box. We have a nice, uh, you know, a few proof coins in here. A lot of really great premium quality coins. And so we're gonna take these back to the house. We're gonna show you guys what these look like, um, but definitely an adventurous day. Uh, so thankful we're able to pick up nice coins like this. And so if you guys wanna check them out, kushacollectibles.com. All right, guys, we just got home. We have so many great coins to show you guys. We have a 76, 1876 proof set. We have an 1887 proof set that we're gonna show you from this collection. And that's not all the coins that we got, but we're gonna create a part two to this video for you guys to watch. But if you wanna see every coin that we have from part one and part two, make sure to check out our website, acousticcollectibles.com. Without further ado, let's show you these awesome coins. All right, so we have two trays lined out for you guys. We're gonna show you the proof Morgan dollar and it's set in just a moment, but let's start off with the 76 proof set. We ended up buying the proof trade dollar a few months ago, so that's not gonna be in this video. We sold that coin, but we bought the rest just recently, I think yesterday. The first coin I wanna show you is this 1876 proof seated half dollar graded proof 64 cameo by PCGS. It's got a little haze to the coin, 
we sent all these coins in the CAC like we said, and this one didn't pass, but it is definitely a neat coin. I think there was just too many hairlines on the obverse for them to give it that exceptional, you know, CAC green bean. But the 1876 quarter is a different story. It does have more hairlines on it, but it is graded accordingly, 63 plus cameo. If you take a look at this coin, I mean, just the fields are phenomenal. Really close to deep cameo, in my opinion, and it is accurately graded. I do agree with CAC on this one. We have this 1876 20 cent piece. Little haste the coin, a few hairlines as well. I think just a, a few hairlines too many, and it held it back from receiving the green bean. A lot of these are just so tough to get right, and uh, sometimes CAC and PCGS just don't agree, but a beautiful coin nonetheless. We have this 1876 proof seated dime, it's rated proof 62 cameo. It is CAC approved. Just a gorgeous obverse and reverse. The strike is not super nice on this coin. There's a lot of chatter in the fields, unfortunately, but a really affordable cameo uh, seated dime. Most of the time in 63 and 4, you're going to be paying double or triple the money for a 62 cameo seated dime. So definitely a neat one. We have this 1876 three cent nickel, grade proof 65 plus deep cameo. I think this is one of two graded by PCGS in deep cameo. And so uh, just a, a neat coin, definitely hard to find, especially CAC approved. We have this 1876 shield nickel, it's graded proof 62 and it is CAC approved. Didn't see too many of these that are CAC approved and it had a really nice look to it. Uh, you know, I think it would be close to a cameo look today, but there is some kind of haziness down by the date, a little bit of that white chalkiness. When you flip over the coin, it has a little bit of that chalkiness above uh, where it says states and a fingerprint, but graded appropriately and a decent piece. Last coin, which is unfortunate, is the 76 proof Indian head scent. It was cleaned and then it was retoned. And so it kind of filled in with this interesting color, but it definitely has been cleaned and is an issue coin. And so we priced it accordingly, but when you're buying a whole set, you got to buy it all. You can't buy just the coins you like. So that one came with these. Let's start off by going to tray number two. All righty, 87 proof set, the big kahuna. So we have this 1887 Morgan dollar graded proof 64. People love proof Morgan dollars because Morgan dollars are so highly collectible. And uh, this coin has a little haziness to it, a few hairlines on the coin as well, um, but definitely a neat piece. 87, seated half, improved 65 cameo. Definitely a nicer cameo look than the other uh, 76. Just a little bit more deeper mirrors, but does still have some haste to the coin also. We have this 1887 proof uh, 25 cent, and it's gonna improve 65 cameo. Has a little tone to the coin, but really strong cameo look to the coin. This one's not as strong as the 76 quarter, but definitely neat. We have this 1887 uh, Liberty V nickel. It's great, proof 66 cameo. Has some kind of bluish purple to the coin. And uh, definitely a tough grade to get, especially CAC approved. And then we have this 1887 Proof seated dime, grade proof 67 plus cameo. So if you guys remember all the way back when we submitted these coins to CAC, we mentioned that they're all in capital holders and that he bought them from a friend. And so these all came back, these grades, which is crazy. Most of the time, a lot of coins have been messed with and they'll never get grades like this one. But this one is a stunner, so tough to find. There's a few in 68, but this is the only 67 plus cameo. We have this 1887 uh, over six, three cent nickel. It's a strong overdate, graded proof 67, and uh, it is CEC approved. Nice look to the coin overall, no distracting issues. Definitely problem free and not, no marks that are really uh, distracting. And then we have this tough coin to find also. This is a proof uh, Indian head set, but it's graded cameo. Cameo, uh, you know, you can just see the the stark difference between the fields and the details. And Indian head scents are not graded cameo very often. I think there's only a few on the pop report. And this one's the lowest graded one, so it's the most affordable. And uh, so happy we were able to pick that up because it's a, definitely a unique offering. And so 
Thank you guys for allowing us to show you these coins. It's been a real pleasure and honor because, you know, we just don't get this opportunity too often and it's really great to see. Thank you guys for watching today's video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure to leave a like. This was a long time coming, a lot of work, a lot of effort to create a video like this, to be able to be holding coins like this in our hands and be able to sell them to you. If you guys want to subscribe, make sure to subscribe. Uh, we also have a video down below if you don't know how to subscribe. Uh, comment your thoughts on what coin was your favorite and what coin you're looking to buy next for your collection. We'll see you guys in the next video.